Welcome to the Morning Offering with Father Kirby, your daily call to prayer. Pray with us every day right here on the podcast and in your inbox. Learn more at morningoffering.com. Greetings, friends. Welcome to the Morning Offering with Father Kirby. Today is Thursday, April 4th, and today I'd like to talk about holy water. But first, let's pray together. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. O oh, Jesus, through the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I offer you my prayers, works, joys, and sufferings of this day for all the intentions of your sacred heart in union with the holy sacrifice of the Mass throughout the world for the salvation of souls, the reparation of sins, the reunion of all Christians, and in particular for the intentions of the Holy Father this month. Amen. In the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Well, friends, as Catholic Christians, we have some amazing sacramentals that are given to us by the Church. And we know sacramentals are given to us in order for us to receive the grace of God. So the object itself has no power in and of itself. So water has no power by itself. But when God works through that water, great things can happen, such as in holy baptism. But also we know that there can be the devotional use of holy water. So water is blessed. It now becomes holy. God will work through this water. And it's such a powerful sacramental given to us. We can go to almost any Catholic parish and get holy water. We can bless our homes. Parents can bless their children. We can bless our cars. In times of temptation or distress or anxiety, or if we think that there might be some bad spirits messing with us, we can use holy water. Any baptized Christian can use holy water. Now, with this understanding, you would think that every Catholic home would have bottles and bottles of holy water, (laughs) that every car would have a bottle of holy water in its glove box. But that's not the case. In some places, it used to be the case, I'm told. But it's not the case now. And we need to fix that. We need to make sure we have holy water in all the different areas in which we might live or work or spend our time. Because holy water is powerful. So imagine you're sitting there at work and you're starting to get tired. Maybe you're starting to slack off. You're like, you know what? My my employer deserves my best. So you get out the holy water, you bless yourself. Lord, give me strength. I'm tired. Please let me do a good day's work, right? Or maybe you're at home and you're flipping through the TV and some other things come on and you're like, oh, this looks interesting. No, it doesn't. Keep going. (laughs) You know what I mean? Don't, don't, don't. Maybe it's some violence or maybe it's, you know, some uh, lewd sexuality or whatever. It's like, no, no, no. And you find your mind going there. Get out the holy water. Bless the TV. Bless yourself. Right? Maybe just turn the TV off. How about that? Right? But use the holy water. So holy water can be used at any time, all the time. And so I want to really encourage you in your discipleship to make sure you're using some holy water. If you don't have any holy water at home, get some bottles of holy water. Put one in your car. At work, put one in your desk or wherever you might be working. If you're out and about, then put it somewhere where you're working. Make sure you let yourself use this powerful spiritual resource. It's a gift. We can be reminded every day of our consecration in Jesus Christ by holy water. We can allow the Holy Spirit to work through that holy water. We can allow times of temptation or distress or anxiety to be reduced by the use of holy water. It's a great gift. Make sure you're using some holy water, dear friend. And those are our thoughts for today, dear friends. I want to thank you for joining me. I encourage you, keep fighting a good fight. And remember, you can receive daily spiritual encouragement sent right to your inbox when you subscribe to The Morning Offering at morningoffering.com. God bless you. Thanks for listening today. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. The Morning Offering with Father Kirby is a production of Good Catholic, the media division of The Catholic Company. For more faith-filled podcasts and videos, visit goodcatholic.com.